I've shown you how to upload to GDocs to open a Word document that you can't open in a local version of Word. This is kind of the quicker version of having to download than upload. If you have a Gmail account and it's, which I'm assuming you do if you're watching this, um, you don't have to download it in order to upload it. Um, when you open anything that has an attachment, um, if it can recognize it, you'll have both view and download. So instead of hitting download, knowing you're not going to be able to open it, you select view, and it'll bring it up, and this is just a one, one little line for a link, but so I can save in Google Docs or I can edit. If I want to print this right away, I'm going to hit edit, because what it's going to do is it's going to convert it, when I'm using this real basic one because it makes it nice and fast. Um, and once it converts it, I can go straight to print. So no downloading, uploading, any of the rest of that stuff. You can get straight from your Gmail email and be able to print really quick. Um, so another thought with this in another email, if you don't want to download it and everything else because you don't really need to save the file, um, especially a version you can't open, um, what you can do is you can forward it to your Gmail account and then do what you just saw here. Um, it's really quick and simple. It makes it nice and easy. And you can also save it to where it saves in your GDocs. Um, that way, if you want to reference it in the future, you still have it and you're saving local resources on your computer. Uh, hopefully that's helped.